what brought you into my office today? You don't have an appointment scheduled and, you paid an extra $200 to have one early. You do realize that if you have an emergency, you should have gone to the emergency room instead, right? I don't like the current flavor of my antipsychotics. If you don't take them you'll have severe withdrawal side effects, that's a bad idea. Do you need involuntary commitment again? I love involuntary commitment, it's happened to me 37 times in my life. I actually owe the big companies $2 million for just being locked in a room with crayons, coloring pages, television and forced medications. It gets pretty lonely in my 50 square foot apartment, I am paying them back $100 a month I hope I pay it off before I perish. It's good to be honest, you know? You do need involuntary commitment, right? Well, actually I'd love to go but my favorite show that I watch on McDonald's Wi-Fi comes on in two days so, I don't want to at this time. Thank you for the offer though. Why did you come in here? You do realize I'm not a therapist, I'm a psychiatrist. Would you like a referral to when I get a kickback for suggesting to you? I can't afford therapy on my $800 a month social security check. How do you come up with the $200 for an extra visit? I've only been eating ramen every day for the past year, except during voluntary commitment when I get a few canned vegetables off to the side. It saves me money on getting a few extra visits out of you. Can you just get to the point you have a 15 minute time limit? I do appreciate your repeated business though. I want a better flavor of antipsychotic. Whichever one is the most expensive for Medicare to bill to make my super cramped $400 a month 50 square foot apartment more tolerable. Don't you understand, all I care about is money? I do, that's why I want your most expensive antipsychotic that Medicare can cover. Sorry that they don't cover therapy. They seem to cover the antipsychotics fully finally. I hope you become extremely profitable. Sure, now we are getting somewhere, thank you so much. I will prescribe you a Zijakija, inject it twice a day, it is not a monthly injection. It has every side effect known to man, and even some annoying ones after that. It costs $8,000 a month before insurance your insurance fully pays for it. It's one of the newest and most revolutionary on the market. That sounds perfect, what kind of illness do I have again? Sorry, these antipsychotics make me think kind of slow. My mind went blank. You have anxiety with no hallucinations, you sued the federal government 50 times and finally won when they were turning you down for social security. Oh yeah, I paid $3,000 into the system as a stressed out 19 year old before I started leeching and feeling super ashamed for my mental illness. I had a mental breakdown in my Taco Bell for 6 months job, I was so stressed when I got fired, I almost got arrested for trespassing. Such a close call. I've said too much. I should figure out how to make my food budget less than $75 a month so I can get more visits out of you. That sounds splendid, hope to see you again soon.